Hey guys, today we're going to talk about two different types of baptisms. At baptism, one is by water. <clears throat> now, I can tell you, if you're on your deathbed and you want to be saved and born again, you can be. You don't need a priest or a pastor there. You don't need to be baptized at that point. Baptism is more or less just signifies kind of like who you're rolling with. And I would be ra I would rather be bathed by water and remain how I am because at the end of my life I will receive rewards for what I'm doing on this channel. Or you can go with a satanic bloodbath. <clears throat> Isn't that nice? Doesn't that look nice, guys? Doesn't that look brilliant? Look, look at these, look at these. Now, instead of bashing these people, now I can't say much about clones because I can never tell a clone from a real person. I'm not into the mainstream media. I watch channels. Sometimes you can tell, sometimes you can't me. I don't worry about it. However, with these people, Taking satanic blood baths, they signify that they want to gain the whole world, yet forfeit their soul. That's all they want to do. They want to <clears throat> live rich, and then when they die... They don't care. <laughs> oh, they will care. They'll care when they start seeing real scary stuff. Now, I'm gonna... What is this? Oh, man. Oh, no. Okay, I see. Yeah, yeah, I know what that is. Anyway, guys, I don't want to show too much because, <laughs> you know, it's too much for me. However, there's two choices here. You take the Jesus Christ's God's born again baptism, or you take the satanic bloodbath. You can still get your soul back. The problem is, people see the power, the short lived power behind Satan. <clears throat> and I don't care what anybody says. It's like when people say, How did this God get to the top of the chart so fast? How did that work? Because he sold out, man. Don't you get it? He went on a casting couch and he sold out. Just like, I think it was Kanye West did. Something about selling a soul. Something about a happy meal. I'm not going to quote it directly because I don't want to. I don't listen to Kanye West. I have nothing against Kanye West. I don't even know Kanye. I don't even know his music. I don't listen to MSM stuff. But this stuff is incredibly dangerous. And I'll show you something. Now, I came across this video yesterday. Say, say as an example, okay, you're a, you're a, you're a music rapper, you're, you're whatever you are. <clears throat> you decide, okay, you know what? Let's do it. Let's, let's sell my whatever. Let me sell my whatever. I don't want to say it because it just, it bothers me. But anyhow, let me do this certain action to become famous. Okay, great. You sign your name and blah, 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 blah. You leave to go home. You get in a car wreck. You end up going into an <laughs> Now, if you could imagine being in, in hell and you have this type of stuff happen to you, I'm telling you right now, and I will show you another video after this. Okay, 
in this scene, this person died in his sin. He is given over to the tormentors of hell. And I know this is an older video, but how do you get your point across without people giggling and laughing like little school children? How do you, how do you make your point known? How do you, how do you do it? It's simply by doing videos and trying to be serious. Hey guys, that's as far as I go with the video, and I'm going to show you another one. Or would you rather end up in a place where, in the last, since the last video I showed you, there's peace and quiet. I turned down the volume on purpose to avoid copyright, if that's possible. I don't know if they would. Think about it. The beautiful, uh, beautifulness of it, the beauty. No torments. No nothing. Wonderful. Look at it. Look, look. I would much rather this than the other thing. Look how beautiful that is. Now, as for people who become Satanists, 
or people who don't believe or are agnostic or, or they are undecided. Instead of bashing them, because I've seen a lot of videos where people are bashing them. Instead of bashing these people, like I said, pray for them. If you pray for them constantly, the Father can work on their heart. I'm going to leave the video as is. I'm not going to edit it or nothing. You can see the, the channels I've went to. I haven't shown them love because I just found out about them. However, I um, would like you guys to think about it. Not freak out. And understand that Jesus Christ died for you. God loves you. Satan doesn't care for you. Satan hates you. Why do you think there's sin? In reality... With no Satan, there is no sin. He's the father of lies. The deceiver and murderer from the beginning. Remember John 3.16, guys. That's my favorite quote. And I will uh, talk to you guys real soon. Thought I'd make a video. It's been bothering me for some time. Because I see a lot of stuff going on YouTube right now. People are like attacking each other. And you know what? One day you're going to die. You're going to die. You have to give an account for what you do. You, you really won't have to give an account if you're saved by the blood of Jesus Christ. So guys, love you all very much. Sorry about slamming that. I love you guys very much. Hopefully I get a few views on this. And uh, I'll talk to you then. Peace out, guys.